Hello and welcome everybody, I'm one proper variant and this is a region in uproar. It's of course CK2 in the HIP mod with Muhammad of Al Hamoudi Revolt. Yes, that is right, we're no longer just the Amir of uh, whatever we are, of uh, Al Abadi Imara. We are the leader of the revolt against the Al Hamoudi Imara. Al Batik has treated us so poorly for such a long time. Now is the time to come out of the bushwork and destroy him right where he stands. And I think that is exactly what we're going to do. That is what we are going to achieve because we are fairly strong. And I don't know what he's sieging there, but. I will prevail. Oh, and you no longer have pneumonia, huh? Now, the last episode was a strange one. We've had our two wives die in just three years' time. We've had uh, plenty of children, just for the record, and we have had a situation happen in which... How do I phrase it? I think the ghost of Walada, you know, her voice still rung in our ears even years after her death. She told us that we would have to rise up and go beyond it all if we wanted our family to do well. And of course, Muhammad, you know, he has seen war. He doesn't like it and he doesn't enjoy any of this, but he knows that it needs to be done if he wants a good future, a better future outside of the realms of those that invaded Iberia, that took over our customs and threw him into the trash. If he wants to prevail and if he wants his family to, uh, to prevail, what we are doing right here, open rebellion, is the only option. I, yeah, this is what I... Yes. Now, we can no longer be the king, of course, but I will become a Grand Duke. That should be fairly easy. We have uh, Algarve, of course, open as well. I'm not going to remarry, but Prince Abad should remarry. Now, I could, you know, envision marrying him only after we became independent. I think that is a, a fair thing to do. And we're going to crush you here. I, I can tell you that much. I am absolutely going to crush you right where you stand, buddy. Don't you even think about sieging down Kamara. Oh, I hate these troops, just for your information. Oh, you know what we're gonna do? Oh, we're gonna crush him in Ishbilia first. Oh, watch this. Oh, this is gonna be painful, my friends. When is the other one? Are ah, they already entirely locked in. Perfect. You know what? And for this... I, I know, he hates war and he hates what he has seen. But for this occasion, he has to be there. He has to lead the armies himself. Rise up to the occasion. Be the man that he needs to be for history. How are you doing? 2.56k troops, huh? Must have hired some mercs. I don't think we need to hire mercs, I'll be honest with you. Why are you hostile to me? Who art though? Who art though indeed? You... Oh, you're just hostile. You're just... Not actually going to come for me. You just exist, is really what the game is trying to tell me. And they siege down Kamona, but... Kamona is ours. They have no chance. You were in the thick of it during the battle, and your tally of slain enemy soldiers has impressed even the most grizzled sergeants in your army. As you clean the blood splatter off your sword and armor, the men cheer you for the bravery you displayed in securing this victory. We are a good fighter. But that doesn't mean that we enjoy it, does it? Let's go to Cordoba. Let's take what they should have never held. Let's destroy these... Inferior versions of the Umayyads. Founding of an empire, look at that. Uh, good old Seljuk has created an empire. Now, this is going to be fairly tight. I gotta tell you straight up. I'm, I'm not gonna lie to you. This is obviously going to be fairly tight. They have a decent amount of troops. I could release prisoners here. Oh, you fool! We got him. This is over. Clap them all in irons. And you know what? I'm gonna milk him. Actually, you know what? I'm not gonna milk him at all. See, think about it. Think about it. Who's, whose daughter are you? An Alamudi daughter. But not the right dynasty. <sighs> oh, this is going to be a turning point for a character, I think. This is going to be a turning point. All of these people that we just captured. They are all in one way or another. I'm gonna, I think I'm gonna release both of you, right? Yes. Okay. We are a kind person. We always have been. But as I said, the voice of our late wife, of our beloved Walada, is still within our ear. And you know what she says. She says you have to eliminate them before they eliminate you. Look at this. We did this. 
Let it be known that we are the ones. It's free Iberia of the Alhamudi dynasty. There you go. Alabadi has risen up and Alhamudi is as weak as they could be. Now I will of course put the crown focus right here into Ishbilia. That's the dream. Sevilla will be our center. The centerpiece of everything that we do of our entire clan. Abad ibn Muhammad. Who could you marry? Who could you marry that would make sense? Maybe a different under Lucy Taifa. I think that would make a lot of sense, honestly. But, oh yeah, no, there you go. Wait, what? You're ruling down there? Seriously? You're Naznata. Wait a minute. Now I'm, now I'm a tad confused. Let me bring me back to who I just was looking at, right? Because we have a... Alpha Timi. That's interesting to see. I saw, I swear to God, I saw someone, right? It was, Andalusi uh, was Andalusian. You. Maybe. I can't even remember if that was, was her. No, that is her house, Al Amiri. But I swear that the Al Amiri. I, th I thought they were. Yeah, look at that. They're no longer in control, I suppose. Does she have a claim? Is that even the one that I wanted to look at? Maybe it's you. I think it is you. You have a weak claim on the Al Yasubi Imara. Which would be inherited. Long term, this could mean a very beneficial marriage for us and our family as a whole. You know, we could just push it. And make our children, uh, Get our children on the throne. There you go. Abad, this will be yours. In the future, of course. Not right now. Just for the record. Look at us. The al Abadi dynasty all of a sudden has risen up to the occasion. I love it. I am absolutely in love with this situation, I gotta tell ya. And we're obviously gonna pull out here. You know. Ridiculous to stand on them, I guess. Uh, we are fairly low in terms of power and, and strength and everything, realistically speaking. Which makes me consider... Hello, Cordoba. We have... Right, of course. We have a good old truce, don't we? We may also... Yep, we still have a truce. Granada, still under Fatimid rule, of course. I mean, technically under Alziri dynasty rule, but the Fatimids are now direct liege lords of the... Uh, Ziri dynasty. So here we are. I think I'm just gonna get rid of you. Let's make some money. Let's become a great duke and then let's look towards the future. Let's look towards our children. Let's look towards those, you know, that haven't decided to serve us yet, but will in the future. We do still have chest pains, I gotta tell you. I'm not too positive about that. Afla is still bringing him up. Man, Afla, you ugly son of a gun. Of course you would believe in God and whatnot. You, you gotta get out of here. <laughs> You need to leave your ugly body behind and become a spirit. Uh, you want to? Yes, of course. Let's have a marry here. I will. What is your education? Right. Um. We don't have. I guess you, but you're not that good. I could push a claim. I could not push her claim. I don't even think I can push women's claim at all. Maybe I can. Maybe I can't. I think I. Honestly, I'm not certain. Now that I think about it. That's a good question. We will see that when it comes to it. What are you doing? Defending in Hamudi revolt and Idris of Al Hamudi's revolt for Al Andalus, meaning it's you. And both of them are so weak. Look at this. The absolute weaklings. No future is ever available for them. I think the Al Hamudi dynasty will fall. Oh, Jesus, how are their vassals so damn positive about it? Uh, I guess they just, you know, granted, were granted baronies and whatnot. But yeah, the way I see it, Amir Muhammad won't live forever. And I'm going to keep focusing on family, of course. Can you, can someone heal me? I swear to God. Did I have a good treatment? I did. Um, I think we're going to give land to Ismail fairly soon. Wait, what? Why do I hold... When did I get Martula? Am I losing my mind? 33. Uh, a couple of months ago. Must have missed that. I must have missed that. Very strange. But either way, what I'm looking at here is essentially the downfall of the Al Hamudi dynasty, and that is gorgeous. That is what I have been working towards for such a long time. Now, of course, we're not yet over the hill. 37, eh? And I'm still 50, and I'm, you know, sick. Not a, not a grand time. Obviously, ooh, he's shrewd, dude. That is excellent. He is a shrewd dude for sure. I mean, maybe Abad would be a good, you know, heir. 
But then again, I, I do think, I do share the opinion that Balada influenced Amir Muhammad in, in such an intense way that he would probably feel it would be absolutely against the spirit of his marriage with her and against, you know, the, the idea of her, you know, death to not honor her, to not put him where he deserves to be, in charge, large and in charge. That's for the record here. I think what we're gonna do is, I think uh, we need how much? 192. I'm just gonna pick up a... Ooh, you're a king now. He's uh, the king of Portugal. Oh, would you look at that? We have uh, two kings around us now. Two damn kings. And I respect neither of them. I will not swear fealty to you. Are you kidding me? Are you out of your mind? Um, let's try to get the domain centralization up. That is what I really care about. I, I gotta be honest with you. That is the only thing that I really care about. Now, some of these cannot actually uh, have me request a council support. But I think the ones that we can get here are absolutely worth it. Yeah, look at them. I'm gonna get these. I'm gonna get this done. I, if Whatever your favor is, give the council more power. See if I care. You know what I care about? I care about changing this damn law. There you go. It has been done. And we are now only one over our domain size. I like it. That is usually where you want to be. Just one. Now, of course, we will clash in the future. Who's Tabit? I don't know Tabit. We will clash in the... Wait a minute, what? Who the hell is Safi? Ah, okay. <laughs> <laughs> Don't worry about it, okay? Uh, we will clash in the future with the Al-Hamudi dynasty, but... I think for the moment, neither of us are interested in a clash. Did he just win his war? Yeah, it seems like it. Young Tasafin often speaks in reverence of the wise men of old, saying he wants to be like them. Tasafin, dude, that's really smart of you, but also I really don't care for you. I have no interest in caring for you. You're a lowborn. I'll just send you off to somewhere. Hmm. We'd like you to back our plot to discredit Shaikh Wanako. I don't really care for... Sh I mean, I guess we're fr friends, but that is so underhanded. I mean, don't even bother me uh, me with it. Now, let's actually become a great duke. I love being a great duke. Makes me feel good. About life and all that. Alright, perfect. There you go. Fulfilled the ambition, did what needed to be done. I will not get married. No way, Jose. Uh, being seen as pious would be kind of nice. Maybe building a war chest, I guess. Strengthen the soon religion. I don't think he's very religious. I don't think he cares for it. Let's uh, be seen as publicly pious. Sounds about right to me. Now, you know, getting these people out of this country is going to be hard. Khalifa al Hakim the Vengeful is very, very strong. And uh, of course, underneath him are the Alziri dynasty. And honestly, they are also quite impressive. I don't like it. I don't like either of it, but you know, you have to deal with what you are given. Or rather, you have to use the cards that you are dealt with. You know, something like that anyway. We're not, at least honestly, we're no longer over the domain limit. That is good. The great duchy has done that for us. Having two duchies, I mean. I promise Wali Abd al Aziz, right? He wants to become. <sighs> he hates me because I think I may have conquered him or something. I can't remember. Once seen on the council, desires the Imara of Al Garb, you won't get nothing. Get out of here. But you are the new spy master. At least uh, until you murder me. <laughs> Please don't murder me. Yeah. Um, I'm not going to give you land. I'm not going to give you any of this. But I will give you the... Uh, hmm. I hate you in that position. I got I to gotta be honest with you. I don't like you being spy master. Maybe I'll make you marshal. I think I'll make you marshal. Are you good at stewardship? You're decent. Um, I will have you become the steward. Which is the Katib. Then I will uh, have you change position. You will become the Kaid. Then I'm going to exchange you for a person that likes me, that absolutely really wants to serve me so, so damn well. There you go. Put it out there. Beautiful. Very, very nice. Oh, and I got a Minister Realm. There you go. And now we are this comfy realm with Sevilla, an absolutely rich province. And soon we'll see who turns out better. Will it be Ishmael? Will it be the other one? Will I die to the sickness and the decision will be made for me by the game? Maybe. Hussein states that his extensive medical experience leads him to the certain conclusion that your symptom is not due to a serious illness and that it will pass quite soon. To ease your troubles, Hussein, uh, Hussein consulted the stars before draining a good portion of your blood. Yeah, that definitely works. That's how medicine works, right? 
<laughs> that is how medicine works. All right, let's push forward. Seek treatment. Yeah. I know that one of my slothful courtiers is capable of more than he realizes. I want to push the courtier into being more ambitious. I believe there's a great potential in that one. Oh, yeah. That's a great one. It is for both of our best. There's the interest of the, on the loan, of course. My subtle ways of pushing Maya into showing her true potential has worked wonders. It is as if she has realized how fun it can be to be ambitious. She's a smart one. Hussein states that his extensive right. Please treat me nonetheless. There you go. Your bed facing eastwards might ease your pain. <laughs> Wait. <laughs> is it because the sun will shine on my face quicker and that means that I get up earlier and that the depression fades? I'm still depressed, just for the record here. Yeah? Man, life truly isn't easy on our lord, is it? Life truly isn't easy. And all this interest, get out of here. Special minor titles. Um, I guess my son should be the regent at this time. Other than that, the court tutor don't really care for it, no. Ishmael, still being brought up by this fellow, that's a good thing. Keep it up. He's a good one, curious. Mirza, of course. With a little bit of a claim to fame there. I'm gonna teach you in... what about faith? No, what about in humility? What about in etiquette? You know what? That has nothing... it will not end up with a good education, but I think it's good for her and, you know, for him as a person, who he is. I inherited Labla. Oh. He just died without heirs, eh? Jesus, that's so much land that we just got here. Well, obviously I don't need this one, but I would like to keep my capital duchy under full control, which is this. I do also, just for the record, hold Agave, which is these two, and I hold all of this now. Jesus, that's amazing. That is absolutely amazing. Uh, do I hold any other... no. We're gonna get rid of Martula, I feel. Actually, Martula is nice. I'm gonna get rid of these two. Because they're not fully recharged. Yeah, I, I like this idea. So I'm gonna give these two away. Do I have good commanders that served me well? I must have some, right? I have some people on the council that could serve me, no doubt about it. Ooh, my... you know what? You're a good friend. You will get... Chilb. There you go, buddy. How, how does that feel? That feels right, doesn't it? Giving land out to friends of mine? I endorse it entirely. Now, as for everyone else, um, I do have some commanders here, and you are really good. Oh, Hussein! Absolutely, my court physician, 100%. You shall get Ukshunbra. Ukshunuba, that's the one. <laughs> Just making up words at that point, eh? Alright, there you go. That's beautiful. Our troop levy, or our levy just in general, is on the rise. I really love it. And we have... Oh, God, we inherited so much money with that dude. That is amazing. Thank you. I accidentally took out a loan. Wrong button. Wrong button and... Oh, yeah, okay, there you go. Uh, <laughs> just paid some money for literally no reason whatsoever. I hate it. But what can you do? What can you do indeed? Good god. How terrible. How terrible. Couldn't even have that button available. Now I will tell you. If I die and I inherit as uh, Abad ibn Muhammad, I think that is fair. He's a good kid. Nothing wrong with him, right? He's a good kid. Question is just, uh, if he grows up to be worth, uh, to be worse than Ishmael, I think I'm gonna give both of them land and they can duke it out later. I mean, obviously I'm gonna give Ishmael more land, or, you know, at least more so that he can be feel good about it, but I wanna be fair to my children. How could I not be fair to my children? I mean, come on. Isn't that just, you know, what it's all about? Ishmael, I really need him to grow up to be a good one, though, and I gotta tell you, we, we're fast-forwarding a bit in the sense that I do wanna move on to, uh... Maybe. A bit of a different child. I just want to see how he turns out. If he turns out poorly, then, you know, obviously no point in caring for him. But, honestly, I think that he, that Amir Muhammad, would still give him the uh, emirate if Ishmael even was terrible. Because at the end of the day, he's the son of the beloved wife. The beloved wife, dude. Not just any wife. Ooh, and we have a child. Well, well, well. If that isn't reason enough... For me to come in and destroy you. Can I do anything interesting here in terms of plots? Not really. Could evoke some cities, I guess, but that's about it. You're being raided. Not really that uh, significant, I would say. And I think we are going to go to war just to make the borders look, you know, at least a little bit better, I guess. I would like to take these two. You know, if I leave them with the entirety of Port uh, Portugal, I think I'll be fine. I think that's cool. But I do want to take either of those. Is held by one, yeah, it's individual people. Good to know, good to know. 
I think we're gonna take the coast here. Ultimately, I don't really care. I just want to establish myself as an even stronger leader than we already are. And I think we can, that, uh, can do that easily right there. Beautiful. Put him on the spot. Get him out of here. Now, he has a decent amount of troops. And I think I will use the money that we just inherited to hire... I think we used the Band of the Hippo earlier, right? They're terrible. Actually, those are not that terrible troops. Honestly, for that tiny amount of money, pretty okay troops. I'm not going to go against that at all. Looking at it, you know. Ooh, and they are coming for me here. You know what? We'll fight him. I'll fight him right here. This is going to be a close one. Definitely is going to be a close one. Do I want to be in that battle? Sure. What does death mean to me anyway? Something like that anyway, right? <laughs> That sounds like our character. But we are going to win. My troops are performing with excellence and my chest is swelling with pride as we keep pressing forward. I turn back to answer the call of a soldier nearby when suddenly there's a sharp pain in my leg. Gritting my teeth, I hear an enemy shouting, Stay down, you foul invalid. Invalid? Invalid? I don't think so. I could duel him and will likely die or accept any injury. You know what? I'll take the injury. I'm brave. I'm not actually brave. No, I am brave. Let's go. And we are, of course, winning this battle because of the reinforcements still pulling in here that will be a huge huge victory right there 75 percent we have one of them in prison and it may even be no okay it's a different count let me take a look here i can't find the count there he is hey buddy give me money god i love getting money i will love the night system because there will be so much in terms of ransom and whatnot in crusader kings 3 i will be i'm so excited for that i'm incredibly excited for ck3 as a whole i think and we are... A friend passed away. Oh, man. Oh, man. My dear friend passed away. Now, let's take him out here. The X PDX Carol is super good, but I still will skip it. There's no doubt about it. It is not appropriate. It is not appropriate for this playthrough. You have been bested, my friend. And you are my new vassal. Hello. How are you? Valifad? You're not angry. Oh, you're a super good dude. Yo. Hey, buddy. To make it clear that we are friends, I will have my son, Ishmael, brought up underneath you, dude. You're amazing. Yeah, I love that. I love that dude. Look at him. He's a mystic as well. He's great. Maybe Craven, but even so, should be fine. Ishmael doesn't have any negative traits yet. As he's growing older, I can see that Tazufin could use some guidance in one of my experienced areas, the art of war. This is my chance to make an effort for the sake of his education. I do not know you. I have no idea. Who this man is. All I know is that apparently he hangs around at my court. <laughs> Who are you? Yeah, no, I, li I like the Alabadi borders here. I don't think we need to blob too much. We could ultimately, of course, you know, found a kingdom. Um, I need the money, I guess, and more duchies. But that shouldn't be that big of an issue, especially if we keep conquering right here the Targ al Advar. Uh, Advar. We only won. Actually, we could found it right here, couldn't we? Oh, I could usurp it, I guess, in 1039. Yeah, no, I'm a huge fan of that. I'm a huge fan of this idea. Getting a decent Alabadi border, and then maybe, you know, our own little kingdom, carving it out of uh, Andalusia, and Andalusia no longer exists because we are independent. This is a new legacy. I don't need to conquer all of Iberia. I want to play fairly, you know, thick, not tall. And what we will also settle on in the future here will be the religion. I have made no proper decision as of right now, primarily because, honestly, there are so many denominations of Islam, and I would love to pick one that is the coolest. The coolest, I tell you. Who are you? I think I'm proud of something, dude. I don't even know who the hell you are. <laughs> who the hell are you? <laughs> never heard of this man. I've never seen this man in my entire life. Ooh, kiddo. Oh, you won't like this. You won't like this one bit. Let's kidnap him. Let's get rid of the Al Saburi dynasty in our favor. How much money am I losing? Is zero? Oh, we are making money. Are you out of your mind? We are making money while employing mercenaries. We are truly powerful. Nobody ever questioned me, you hear me? We are truly powerful. How are we doing this? Absolute legends. Our income is, is absolutely legendary, no doubt. Big treatment. I am still sick. Are you out of your mind? Also, stop leading the army right now, please. Just sit down at home and relax a bit, okay? My health went up. I appreciate it. I could die any second, just for the record. Dude, I like this kid. How are you doing? 
I mean, he's not bad. Honestly, I would be okay with either of these. I think both of these would fare well, uh, well in the actual, you know, environments of Iberia. But I gotta tell you, what do you think should be our border goals? Of course, of course, you know, if we revert, for example, to one of the more, uh, oh yeah, more authority is down, isn't it? Oh, the Caliph has actually gone, dude! Al-Zahir grew up the last of the Abbasids. Well, no longer last, he has a child, but the Caliphdom of Sunni Islam is gone. Sunni Islam is as weak as can be. Oh my god. With what should we go? We have a Zaidi over there now. Maybe Ibadi. Honestly, it will all be up. Maybe Mulham Ismaili. It will all be up to uh, our eventual heir. I don't think Amir Muhammad is one to make a decision like that. I don't think he cares for religion that much. He has his personal faith, but that is also about it. I think that is indeed also about it. We are incredibly powerful, just for the record, especially for the tiny size of our realm that we indeed hold here. Mm, observing Ramadan could be nice, but we are sick, so that's not going to be a thing that we're going to do, I think. And I will tell you, please let me know in the comments what we should be looking at in terms of a, you know, maybe permanent religion in the future. Of course, nothing is guaranteed. Oh, and look at Big Poland. I love it. They have a personal union with Hungary. I endorse this. The Piast dynasty has risen up to the occasion, inherited it. Wow. Very, very simply inherited it. The Arpad dynasty still has 13 living members, but no males that were ready to inherit, and there you are. Now, I will tell you, let me know what you think we should do in terms of religion. That is nothing permanent, seeing as it will be depending on our eventual heir. But Amir Muhammad has established the al Abadi dynasty as an independent Taifa, and maybe in the future as an independent kingdom as well. And maybe we should just, you know, like become Andalusia Alandalos long term. Either way, I want to thank the members of the channel that are directly supporting the series and this channel as a whole that keep it all going. Thank you, Aaron, Stefan, the richest T Snywolf uh, and Sai, that were all of the barons. Then the Counts, I am Deadpool, Kiamelik 2 and Suspicious Dark, and last but not least the wonderful Dukes, Nathan, Herman, Knight of Squires, Kenneth, the absolute legend, Eric, Lexo, and Benedict and Roboman780. Thank you so much for supporting the channel. I really appreciate it. If you also want to support the channel, check out the join button right under the video. There you can see membership tiers and perks. And alternatively, if you still like some games from the Paradox Store, check out the affiliate link in the description. If you buy games via that link, I will get a share to no extra cost for you. I'll see you in the next episode. Later. Alligator.